Hmm, is it working? Okay, hi guys, come back to some more Kingdom Come Deliverance. So, after uh, winning the fist fighting competition over here, uh, we are, uh, we have found out about the meeting place for uh, those guys. We do need a little bit of food. Um, let's go for some. Dried fruit seems fine, and like a dried meat. All right, 92 is good enough for now. We'll need to grab a little bit more food, but that's a big of an issue. We have money for ages, so yeah, they did know about the crimps, and apparently they are like a that, like a church. And um, it's still night time, so I will go and try it and be there while there's still time, so I don't have to like um, wait until the next day. Bring out my torch, because I can't see anything otherwise. Alright. Wonder. Hey, I'm glad you came! Oh, very glad that the people still like me. I was actually wondering. What is my reputation over here in, um, uh, what is it, Sasao? It's still pretty good. Hmm. I thought it would be, you know, much lower considering the fact that I stole from those guys. Even though, like, I did convince the guards to leave me alone through, like, reasoning or intimidation, but... Yeah, I thought it would have a bigger impact on my reputation. Anyways, let us see over here. I'm guessing this is where we enter the church. Somewhere around here, there you go. Should be some light somewhere. Here or not exactly sure. I hope I'm not going in circles or anything. The fuck is this? Ah, oh, okay. That was weird. Yeah, this is um definitely the church. Are they supposed to be lights on at night? Uh, I'm gonna meeting place and try to find out from them the location. Do we still have the um, info? Okay. In the evening in the Sasso church on hollowed ground. If there is a light in the church after dark and the door is open, I have to go in, kneel before the other player and wait. Tell me here, I'll have to pretend I want to join them. Mm. Okay. <laughs> oh so, God! You've been looking for us, eh? What is it you want? Huh? Your fucking head! I hear you're hiring men who don't mind getting their hands dirty. Is that so? From where did you hear that? Taverns and the like. People talk. Well, that's a pretty tale. But no one in any tavern told you to come here and wait, did they? So let's have it. Who told you? Hmm. The bailiff's man told me about you. The one who runs the fight club in the quarry. How <laughs> did he now? Well, I hope you trounced him. Bastard took my money at dice. If you want, I can give him a proper hiding. Just to show you I'm serious. Spare mm. me the boasting. I've got a test ready for you. Let's see how you handle it before you tell us how wonderful you are. Oh, wow. Test. Nothing complicated. We used to take anyone who looked like they could keep their head on straight. But not now. Now you can only join if you do what we tell you. Which is what? Steal something? Nah, not theft. 
If you want to join us, you have to kill Pius. Who's Pius, and why should I kill him? That's none of your business. But I'll tell you anyway, because it's an instructive tale. Pius was one of us, but mm. we fucked up. How? Did he steal something? Yeah, that was part of it. Stole some money, ran away. A few boys died over it. Showed a distinct lack of loyalty. And as soon as he's dead, you can join us. Okay. I'll have to find him first. <laughs> you don't need to find him. We know where he is. Then why haven't you killed him yourselves? <laughs> it's quite a test. He's hiding in a monastery. With the stable boys? It's not hard to get into the grounds. <laughs> no, hmm. not there. Well, he would have been dead long since. He's in the, uh, cloister, or whatever it is. But only monks can get in there. <laughs> Just monks and pious. He's an educated hmm. bastard. Seems he used to be a priest, but it didn't quite work out. I mean, the name kind of... The name kind of gives it away, doesn't it? Uh, right. Okay. How am I supposed to get into the cloister? You'll think of something. Maybe there's a secret passage. I've heard there's some cave underneath. The cave of St. Procopius. There might be a way into it from outside. And do you have any other ideas besides secret passages? Well, there is this one fellow I've been hanging around the taverns. Supposed to join the monastery soon. Might be he could help you somehow. I'd try talking to him if I were you. And if he doesn't help, knock him on his ass and take anything he's got that you could use to pass yourself off as him. A letter of admittance to the monastery, or whatever. Hmm. How will I recognize Pius? He won't have been there long. He should be the only new one there. But what if there are others? What does he look like? Normal. He always went about well-dressed and had a fine-looking dagger. Yes, except he'll be given a robe and they'll take his knife. Then you'll have to try and figure out which one of the novices it is and get him to betray himself. Try getting him drunk. Then send him straight to hell. Get him drunk? In a monastery? <laughs> yeah, we're better. There's more wine there than in the royal cellars. <laughs> and I doubt he's suddenly stopped drinking. Well, that's pretty interesting. Sacrilege. Fine. So I've got to kill Pius. He's in the cloister, and to get into the cloister, I'll need to enlist the help of some boy who's joining the order, right? More or less. And now the main thing. The main thing is to kill him, isn't it? <laughs> of course. But that's not all. All hell's gonna break loose in the monastery after the murder. So, either make sure nobody finds him, or hightail it out of there quick as soon as the job's done. But better if they don't find him right away. And what else? Should I come back here afterwards? No, no. Before you run for it, take his special dice and bring it as proof that you killed him. And if you can get him to tell you where he hid the coin, bring that as well. Bring his dice and the money if I find it. And where should I bring it? From the monastery, head east across the river. Uh... There'll be a swamp where you'll find a fire pit. Go there at night and light the fire. Make it nice and big and we'll show up. Take the dice and the money, and then tell you where to report. Got it? Right, I'm to slip into the best guarded place in the entire region and kill someone. Take his dice and money, and then go to the swamp and wait by the fire. Yeah, that's the idea. <sighs> well, you can at least say a few Hail Marys for me. I'm gonna need all the help I can get. <laughs> and remember, we'll be keeping tabs. So don't you try to run off, alright? Oh, fuck me. It seems overcomplicated. Could, could I have just killed them all here and there? I mean, sure, there was an archer up top and three guys, but I think it would have been doable. What the fuck is that? Ah, uh, things turned out. I, I was going to tell him, but. Not like not right now. Um 
All right, poverty, chastity, and obedience. What the fuck? Where? Where? Oh. Wait, what do we have to tell Sir Radzig? Oh, what the bandits want us to do? Hmm. Yeah, it is uh, kind of complicated. Complicated mission. So we can either uh, either enter the monastery like with the help of that novice guy, or try to infiltrate it through the secret passage. I I know somewhat about it. It's the same one that that guy asked me about to like so that he could touch the sacred relics and I never actually been able to get into that passage but like I know what it, he means by it um, I'm gonna go and check with the novice guy first since he's closer and if Things don't go pretty well, and maybe after that we'll talk to the Razik. Thank God I went along these roads a couple of times, and I know my way around. It's so hard to see at night. Oh, we don't know which one he is. Oh Jesus, what the hell? Why are they all so fucking... Zombified? What in the actual... Okay, let's see, maybe he is over here. No. Then he must be most likely asleep in some place. Oh, the fresco master. Sorry for waking you up, my buddy. I must be one of these two guys. Ah. Yeah, it's too early to do, I mean, too early or too late, depending on how you look at it, to do anything. Try the infiltration route, maybe it's less guarded at night. I don't know. Mm, yeah, the Santley remains. Exactly. Let's check, out of curiosity. There is the church. I'd have to go across it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, watch. Careful. And then somewhere over here. From like the construction yard, you could access it. remember correctly. Hmm. Let me see, let me see. Hmm. I think it's the other side. Sup fellas? Going to sleep this early? Over here, it's all locked up. It's interesting that they locked us into the church and then slipped the key beneath us. Like, why would they do that? But yeah, whatever. Oh, the guard is here. Hmm. What are you doing here? Get lost. 
Could help you. Are you guarding Procopius Cave? That's right. Otherwise, people would steal absolutely everything. <laughs> I'm not sure, but I think workers at the monastery were looking at one little bone, and it looked like they were touching it for luck. Again? That thieving rabble? I'll show them. That worked better than expected. The question is... Oh, it's ladder. The question is how do we access that place? Because it's not from here. Clearly, been through here before. It's not from up over there either. So it must be this. This is like very hard to open. Yeah, I can't do anything here. Oh, maybe the key is here. Hmm. Could be it. Oh, no, it isn't. God damn it. Ah, that's so annoying. How oh, in the bloody hell? Maybe it's over here. No spade and torches. Ah. Uh, oh, maybe over here. Ah. Uh, Just as I thought, there aren't any remains here. <laughs> okay, I get it. Hmm. Looks ordinary. A bit too ordinary. Okay, so I done that done that side quest. Hmm, but there's no way to access the church from here though. It must be that get better remains really you're gonna tell me that that's not enough uh, well that? then hey you halt what surrender you've committed a crime and I'm arrested all right you, you win Post what have I done now I'll teach you what clear off hey. means. Well, you won't Are forget you this in a hurry, because it'll take a nice pile of coin to fix it. Uh, really now? Enough. What impertinence is this? Do you really want me to lose my temper? But I was just... you... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. You can go. <laughs> oh man, it's so good. I love it. Um, anyway, that it doesn't quite work out. Let's just go back to Rai and talk to Sir Radzik. Maybe he can give us advice on how to deal with this situation. And in any case, it's at least gonna get, like, daylight so we can see where the hell we're going. And we try to make the mission, and maybe buy some food and the rest up, I don't know. Man, that road over here, like, having to go around. Ugh. Annoying. Please, move a little bit faster. Like, when you're fast traveling from a cutscene, it goes like... You know, just like that. Very, very fast. When I'm fast traveling normally, I have to wait... Fucking ages. Oh, finally. It's 
still pretty early, so we might catch him asleep again. <laughs> um, it's funny. Hello, guys. Welcome, Henry. Yes, I'm glad to see you too. Can we eat while we are on top of a horse? Now we have to dismount to eat. Dismount on the other side. Alright. Hope it's not too much to get us over the limit. Oh, come on. Ah, uh, never gonna get that buff. It was 24, okay. So try and remember eating from a pot is 24. Don't need the torch no more. Pardon me. Ah, there you go, all awake. Greetings. What business have you? <clears throat> so, this investigation into the Neuhoff massacre. It's getting a bit complicated. What have you found out? I tracked down a gang of robbers who recruited killers for Pribislavitz. They know the horse owns who torched Neuhoff. That's excellent news. Did you find out any more? So far, not much. If I'm going to infiltrate them, I have to do what they say. That means murdering one of their former cronies. A fellow they call Pius. Apparently he was at Neuhoff too. Oh yeah, I remember. You have to kill a criminal to prove yourself to them. Huh. I don't much like the sound of it. That's not the worst of it. This Pius is hiding out in the monastery pretending to be a novice. I'd have to get inside the cloisters to get at him. <laughs> Good God above, that's another matter entirely. They don't let just anyone into the cloisters. And the abbot won't give up any of the novices. Secular law has no jurisdiction inside the monastery. Hmm. But this is the second time that something untoward has happened there. First the counterfeiters, now this. I'd be glad to have someone take a look inside. Hmm. It seems like the only way to find Pius is to join the order. Damned if I know how, though. A bit of meditation and learning would do you good. If it's really the only way to get to him, then you'll have to do it. I'm sorry I can't be of much help. <laughs> Sadly, my relations with the monastery aren't entirely congenial. You'll have to figure something out for yourself. What should I do with Pius once I find him? Don't kill him. Bring him to the bailiff in Rate. He'll interrogate the man and give him a fair trial. It doesn't sound mm. like an easy task, sir. Getting into the cloisters, finding Pius, and then getting him to the bailiff. Far from it, lad. But I have confidence in your abilities. Mm. Instead of giving us a solution, hey. fucking made it even more difficult. Like before, we just had to uh, kill the guy and get uh, get the stuff for the uh, guys to infiltrate them. Now I have to fucking capture him instead and bring him back to what the fuck ever. This is getting. Like he said, really complicated. But hey, we have no choice in the matter. So let's go back to Sasso. At least we are well fed. So no worries about that. It's gonna be a long episode full of nothing much, really. They did say that the game would start to pick up pace after some point. You know, that it goes a little bit slow at the beginning with the first few quests, but after some point it pick up picks up pace and you go going it a little bit better, but somehow don't exactly get that feeling from it. Feeling like I have to go through so many different side quests and hurdles just to find like one dude who wait he's just like the underling of the secondary boss of the main guy who is collected to the fucking main quest and ugh does it ever end 
Mm, all right. Well, regardless of my endless rambling. Ow! Ow! Sorry. Eh, it's, of course, it's hard to steer sometimes. Oof! Hard to stop as well. Jesus. Come on. It's really annoying at some point. And apparently now the horse is silent. It's like... Best engines over here. Seven Brawler. Hmm. Super interesting in talking to that guy. What the hell are you doing? Nothing much, really. Are you still sleeping, you fucking lazy fuck? This is unreal. Maybe he's over here. Any chance of a boy to eat? Good health to you, Henry. Thank you, thank you, yes. I'm honored that a knight. Um You wouldn't be Carl by any chance? No. <laughs> well, Master Painter, are you still short of coin? Yes, unfortunately, and my offer still stands. Don't you want to? No, Sorry, but I don't have... not right now. I did buy for things from him, so they just have to ask I'm people. You wouldn't be called, but... no. <laughs> uh. I hope I. You wouldn't be. No. I don't know if this is. fucking hilarious or anything. What? Are you volunteering to get your head smashed in? Hmm. That's right. Let's go. I'm hungry. I'd like a bite to eat. Certainly. I'll fetch it right away. No. There you go. No. He had to finish his drink. Ow! Ugh! Ugh! Oh! Ah. Yeah! Should I not fight in a place a little bit more... Like... Uh... Without people? Oh, he is done for. Completely demolished. Oof. That was okay. God save you. You wouldn't be no. No. Okay. Wait, maybe we should just talk to the innkeeper, maybe he knows if there is a Carl that he's in. You wouldn't be no. It is so dumb. So fucking dumb. Oh my god. Yeah, this guy is Carl. Yo, wake up! Yo ho! I don't know why I'm... Oh, okay. Finally woke up. Victim got away more like... Victim is finally awake. Where are you sticking your fingers? God! Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> oh!
Oh, stop it, you. I just want to talk. Well, I could have went better. <clears throat> well, I got his stuff, I guess. So we could try and do it um, that way. Oh yeah, we should also like... Oh, we didn't... I mean, we leveled up, but we didn't get level up enough to have some new skills. Never mind. So let's see how we would look like. I mean, if we ignore the armor, looks alright. Wait, are we like wanted over here now, or? Hmm, no. Did he not find a guard? Huh. I'm not sure what's happening. <clears throat> Need to remember which are ones are mine at the end of this. Um ah, there you go, he's up. And he's gone. Th th this quest is going more and more stupidly as time passes they're still trying to alert the guards god damn this is terrible pardon me sorry excuse me Let's see if we can infiltrate the monastery. Can I take a look inside the monastery? What's got into you, boy? The grounds inside the monastery belong to the monks of the Order of Saint Benedict. No others shall pass. Uh, but I am um, okay. Hey, I did. Let's deal with this first before we. And now I'll fix you good and proper. You'll soon learn. What? Yeah. You dare to ask? Even if I ignore your other crimes, your brawling is reason enough for me to clap you in irons. This definitely won't come cheap. You'll learn crime doesn't pay. How much do we have to? That's not even much, dude. Are you pulling my pizzle? Don't you know who I am? If that's how you want it, you idiot. Okay, fine. Damn it. Here's your coin then. You purge yourself before the law. But give me back the stolen goods and show me what else you have on you. Oh, really? Are you serious? Did we lose all the Yeah, we did. Ugh. Fine. Well, that didn't work out. Why didn't we manage to convince him, though? Like, we had way over the necessary skill. This is something that... It happened before as well, and I don't understand why. Like, do I have to use different techniques, or... Does it not work sometime? Hmm. Great, well, and next. Not what I'm interested in, I just want to figure out how the fuck do I do this quest. Good day, Henry. Yes, yes. God be with you. Mm hmm. Please don't tell me he's back to sleep again. Okay, he's not. 
volt. Uh, Tarn Brawler, no, we deal with that, no. Hmm. Uh, Matthew, yeah, we're not looking for that. I am so confused. I genuinely don't know what the fuck am I supposed to do here. Uh, well, I guess I'll quit for a while and try and figure it out somehow. Well, I might have done the game in a way that it was not intended, but apparently inside the room where they slept there is a chest that I lockpicked, and from that I have gained the... Um, the... what's it called? Um... The uh, monastery entry writ that um, I'll be able to use, plus a few um, purse, uh, purse with coin and uh, some fancy clothes if I want to dress like them, if it's like really necessary. But hopefully we won't need to. Oh god, where the fuck did we go? There you go. So weird how it continues going. When you go into the inventory screen, but regardless, don't let us stop. Check how am I doing? I did level up on um, horsemanship. It's pretty good. We'll run faster, rider of the storm. Hmm, knight. Ooh, cool. As long as no one hits him. Throw you outside of combat. Alright, uh, let's get knight. Let's be a proper knight over here. And yeah, we can eat something. Like a salami. Mm -mm. Now, let's find that. Um. Brother Pro pa Potter, but I'm Carl. I'm supposed to enter as a novice. We expected you sooner. Weren't you supposed to come here with your guardian? It's been so hectic lately, people will keep turning up out of the blue. Uh came before me. I could have got drunk, couldn't get up. Okay. What of it? I'm here, aren't I? Well, you're a bit bold, aren't you? Well, the brothers will soon knock that out of you. <laughs> well, we'll see. Can you read and write? Naturally. I wouldn't be here otherwise. Hmm. So then, are you ready to enter the Order of St. Benedict and renounce forever the temptations of this world? I am. <laughs> then you must rid yourself of all your worldly possessions. Sell them or give them to the poor and needy or donate them to the monastery. You may not enter this place burdened by worldly goods. Inside the gatehouse is a trunk in which you will find monks' robes. Put away all your possessions and dress yourself in the habit. Then you may rest a while, while I go and see the prior to arrange matters for your acceptance. Okay. God damn it, dude. I have to put away all my shit. All your worldly goods and... Stuff. Yeah, right. A strange feeling being without all of that. I didn't realize how much I'd grown used to it. Yeah. You don't think? Everything's prepared. It's time for you to take your vows. Do I really have to wear this? <laughs> You'd better get used to it. You'll be wearing it for the rest of your life. Yeah, that's not very fancy. Sorry about that. I like I had to open a tutorial in the background just to figure out what was going on with these quests. You weren't supposed to beat up Carl. You were supposed to 
convince his guardian to let him speak to him and convince him to give you that and then bribe the guardian and then something complicated kind of went a little bit like short path but you know Which one of them is fucking pious? Brothers in Christ, we have gathered here today to welcome a new novice into our midst. Dear brother, Forget your former life and embrace your new vocation in the community of the monks of St. Benedict. Opus Dei, obedientia, obprobria, the service of God, obedience, and endurance of all discomfort. These are the cornerstones and succor of our order, which on this day shall become your own. Okay. Suscipe me, Domine, secundum eloquium tuum, et viva. Can someone translate this for me? me please. Why do they put so much attention on details in this game? At least in some of the games. Suski Peme Domine Secundum In Loquium Tum Vivam Et non confundas me Ab expectatione me uh, <sighs> Accept your new name, Brother Gregor, and wear it with honor. Welcome, brother. So we are now Gregor, not Carl, not whatever else. Hmm. All right. With the perk light armor, did we have that perk? I don't remember. Is it the the one from the armor or? Uh. Welcome, brother. I am Antonius, a novice like you. I've been instructed to guide you around the monastery and tell you what you can expect and what your duties will be. Mm -hmm. Thanks for helping me out during the ceremony. I had no idea what I was supposed to do. You don't know Latin, do you? Don't worry. Work in the scriptorium will teach you fast enough. Why exactly are you here? Was it your choice? Or did someone force you to come? Um... It was my choice. For a common lad like me, it's the easiest way to get an education and do something worthwhile with my life. It looks like we're both here for the same reason. I think we'll get along. Uh, Would you tell me something about yourself? I'm a novice and I'm here because I'd make a poor merchant. I like books and I want an education. Although I must say, so far the monastic life's been quite unexpected. Hmm. Let's go then. Good. Unexpected. But before we do... Here's a letter directly from the prior telling you all your regular duties from tomorrow onwards. Make sure to read it this evening so you know how things work. Right, we can go now. Follow me closely. I'll explain everything as we go. Oh, Remember boy. one word. 
discipline. It's your job to work and pray. You serve the Lord now, not your own bodily needs. What is the... Oh wait, I'm curious. What is this light armor perk that I have right now? The fuck? Uh, buffs. Oh, uh, yeah. I completely forgot about that. Interesting. Oh, we discovered the monastery. Right, we're now inside of it. Hey. Peace be with you, brother. Right. This is the way to the dormitory, where we all sleep. You'll find a free bed there, which is now yours. Mm -hmm. Do you know the first thing the monastery taught me? To appreciate sleep. We rise before dawn every day. Takes a bit of getting used to. Yeah. Oh, we got to learn a little bit this about... This is the garden. A place for silent contemplation and meditation. Centuries ago, this monastery was founded by the most esteemed of brothers, Saint Procopius. His earthly remains can be found in a cave under the monastery, and his spirit wanders the corridors at night, punishing any misbehaving novices. <laughs> really? So beware. <laughs> okay. Here are the fratery and scriptorium, together with the library. These are the places where we work. Ora et labora. Pray and work. Pray and work, huh? As a novice, you must always listen to your superior brethren. And above us monks are the prior and the circators, who punish every infraction. You'll know them by the canes they carry. Do what they say. Oh, God. Must be the canteen. This is the refectory, where we come together to eat. During meals, you must be silent. Only one brother reads aloud from the rule of Saint Benedict. The rule is the only law we recognize, with the exception of those from God himself. If you break any of its precepts, expect a swift punishment. But I've already told you about the circuitous. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Ooh. The library. The pride of our monastery. A trove of learning. We don't just read books here. We also copy them. You too will learn how. And that's all. Today you are still free from duty. But tomorrow you begin work like the others. Mm. If you need anything, ask any of the brothers. We'll be glad to help you. And I recommend you get to know the other novices. You already know me. Then there is Siskin, Yodok, and Lucas. Ah, uh, they don't have their Thanks previous name. Around. There's a lot to learn here. Your search for Pius. Hmm. Why can I not uh, select anything else? What's going on? The game is stuck. Because I opened the fucking book before. Oh my god, are you serious? Nothing is working. Please tell me I didn't lose too much progress with this shit. Oh my fucking god. Alright, let's see. I'm no priest, but tell me what you've done. It's probably nothing to worry oh, about. Oh boy. I'm here in the monastery looking for a thief. He had a hand in burning down the Neuhof stud. You don't say. And who are you to take such an interest? Hmm. Someone whose job it is to investigate the case, find the perpetrators, and make sure they get the punishment they deserve. Punishment? You intend to punish them here, in the monastery? I don't know yet. I'm still just on their trail. Perhaps you could help me find him? The hmm. missing thief? If I knew anything, I'd tell you. But I suppose it must be one of the novices. I've only recently heard about the Neuhof incident. And all the other brethren have been here much longer than that. I know. Aside from me, there are only four novices, but still, I don't know which one he could be. Three? Please, <laughs> leave me out of it. And you're right that it could be any one of them. No one knows anything about Lucas. Siskin might be a lot of things, but a monk isn't one of them. And Yodok is a slimy worm. It wouldn't surprise me if he was behind that massacre. Actually, the more I think about it, the less I like that Yodok. 
He's a treacherous rat who'd do anything to get in someone's good books. The thought of Yodok at Neuhof since chills up my spine. Hmm. <sighs> Maybe you're right. It's not a pretty thought. Thanks for your help. And please don't say a word to anyone. Don't fret, my friend. Your secrets are locked inside my lips. Well, he's apparently very, um... Uh, cooperative. I'd like to ask you something about the monastery. And yes, I already asked. I already asked him about all those. So yeah. Well, there's that. Slow down, brother. Sorry. This library is big. Look at all the books here. We can can actually transcribe. Gun. Et dium dynamicum. Uh, contemplatus in Sertare God is Messiah. Hmm. Uh, so we have to like guess which is correct. <laughs> it's pretty interesting. Seems to be Salumus there. Um, is it always the middle one? Alright, I think I might have done good. That sound of writing though is so... Ugh. Interesting. Very interesting. Um, yeah, this is basically the top when it comes to the forbidden books. Oh, you're interested in what's cabinet. inside? Forbidden books written by the devil himself. Forget about them. Forbidden books? Praise be to Christ, brother. I'm Gregor, a novice. I know, but I've no time for idle chat. Hmm. I transcribe books from dawn till dusk. I've been doing it for years, and I'll be doing it till the day I die. What, you do nothing else? Hmm. It is my penance and my blessing. And now, brother, if you don't mind, I'd like to get this page finished. Okay. Yeah, and it's very hard to unlock that book, that, that place. It would be interesting, though. Got my curiosity now. Oh, the papal season. Right. Well... So we could lockpick this one though. I don't have the lockpicks. Uh, yeah, now I get why I should have asked him about it. Right, because I left everything. Jesus. Everyday labors. Um, 3 a.m. start of the day. Jesus. 4 a.m. prayer. Common meal. Work in fratry. Work in library, afternoon worship, vespet, common supper, free time before retiring, rest and nighttime curfew. Jesus Christ be praised. Wow. That is rough, dude. Neglecting my daily schedule. Fuck that. God be with you. Suck to him. Greetings, brother. I'm Gregor and I'm new here. Greetings to you, brother. I'm Yodok, the oldest of the novices. I hope mm. you'll like it here in the monastery and that you won't get into trouble. Trouble? <laughs> You're young, perhaps intemperate. You might easily stray from the rules of the order. 
do you get to know the older monks? You never know when it might come in handy. All right. I'm interested in the other novices. Do you know anything about Antonius? Only that he came to the monastery voluntarily because he didn't want to work in his father's shop. Antonius is all right. You can rely on him. He won't betray a confidence. He's always happy to help, which is more than can be said for the other brothers. Interesting. Can you tell me something about yourself? I would if there was anything noteworthy to say. But I'm just the ordinary son of a landowner, now a monk. There's nothing in my past, present, or future that anyone could find interesting. Mm. Why did you join the monastery? Because it was better than living in poverty. As the youngest son, I'm not entitled to inherit my father's estate. But he was kind enough to sell off some cattle and send me here. And you know what? I'm glad to be here. It's better than mucking out manure. <laughs> Listen, there's something I ought to tell you. There's a dangerous criminal hiding in the monastery, and I came here to look for him. Ha! I knew it! He's a villain! Uh, who are you, though? <laughs> oh, it, it's better not to ask, isn't it? It's always safer not to ask. Never mind that. Who's a villain? That's Siskin. I always thought he was an odd one, the way he carries on. But now it makes perfect sense. He's a criminal fleeing justice. They accuse each what other. Talking about? You clearly know something I don't. I'm telling you, keep your eye on him. He's no monk. That's what my gut tells me. And my gut's never wrong. What are you going to do to that fellow once you find him? Hmm. I don't know yet. You should talk to the Circators or the Prior about it. Not act on your own. Hmm. I'd like to ask you something about the monastery. Uh, don't really care about that. Who would you vote for as the new abbot if you could? Why do you care? We don't have the right to vote, so we shouldn't get mixed up in it. I'm just interested, that's all. <laughs> I like John better. But like I've said, it's not our place to get involved. It's enough that Antonius is mixed up in it. Don't you start too. Okay. Um... Can't sleep and prays long into the night. Is Antonius? We already talked with him. Oh, pardon me. What's down here? Where the hell are we going? Oh, that's okay. Not supposed to be there then. Ah, god damn it. He's trying to find the others. He might be going to sleep though, what's time it's almost curfew time. Oh we should go as well. We don't even have a torch, so we won't be able to light things up. Once it gets dark. Watch your step, brother. Sorry. Watch your step, brother. My god, these people. The fuck is Slow over down, here? Brother. Oh, it's up. Still Yoda. God damn it! How do I keep finding him but not the others? Why is the door now okay? Pay more attention. Hmm. Wait, let me check the objectives really quick. Find out which one of them is pious. Hmm. 
I'm gonna have to do that in the morning though. At 3 fucking a.m. If you can't believe that. Alright, well, anyway, we have infiltrated the church successfully. But, uh, yeah, I think we'll leave out this part of the investigation for next episode. So, hope you guys enjoyed watching. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe to see more. It's gonna be interesting trying to figure out which one of those guys is. I do believe that it's not Antonius. Seems like a good, trustworthy guy. And I don't know about the others. But it really could be everyone, anyone. So yeah, we'll have to see about that in the next episode. So if you guys enjoyed watching, make sure you have a like and subscribe to see more. I'll see you next time. What are we going to make? There they are. I... Okay, sorry. Talk to him in the morning. See you guys next time. What are we going to make? Bye-bye.